Now let's listen again, keeping the rhythm in mind, to this, the downstroke sweep picking. Okay. Keep the, don't forget about the rhythm. Where are the notes getting choked off to you? Well, as soon as I asked you, you started choking them. <laughs> but you weren't choking them before that. It depends, actually. It um, doesn't happen all the time. Okay. So that means you can do it right sometimes, right? Sometimes, yeah. So we have to identify... What happens when we do it right sometimes, and what happens when it's not right sometimes? Yeah, What's, I'm, I'm there's not a aware difference. of it. Okay. How would we make ourselves become aware? What would, what, what would have to happen to become aware? I don't know. I tried a couple of things, but... Well, let's try, try and think it through. What would have to happen in order for us to become aware of the difference between when we do it right and when it's not quite right. How, how can we become aware? Oh, okay. Imagine that I'm not here and there are no guitar, you're the last person alive on earth and there's no guitar teachers that don't exist anymore. <laughs> it's just you. What, what are you gonna do? Okay, I can slow down. I oh, can. yeah, we can slow down. Yeah, yeah. we can slow down. Yeah. I can focus more on my right hand. Yes, you could do that too. I can look at it. And now, try to figure it out. Yeah, slow down. Okay. Focus on the right hand. Exactly. I'm going to give you one other suggestion. Right now, your pick is angled quite severely. Okay. Look at the tip of my thumb, okay? Watch, right now my thumb is about that distance from the string. Okay. If I just take the pick, rest it on the string, my thumb's about that far away. If I angle the pick more, mm -hmm. what happens to my thumb? Where's it going? I don't see actually that. Here's where it was, uh -huh. there's where it is now. Is my thumb getting closer to the string or farther away from the string or staying the same? It's actually, it's still on strings. Um. Forget, we're not talking about these strings. We're talking about the string that I'm about to play. Oh, okay. I'm going to go. play the G string. Mm -hmm. Here's where my thumb is now. My yeah. pick is on the G string, going mm -hmm. to play it. If I increase the angle of the pick like this. It's getting closer. Yeah, it's getting closer. Yeah. What happens when it gets too close? It touches it. Yeah. And when it touches the string, what's the sound? The sound got, gets choked, yeah. right? So we don't want the thumb coming closer to the string. We need to keep it away from the string. Okay. 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 So the problem is caused because the angle of the pick is too severe. When it's being choked, it's caught, in your case, mm -hmm is being caused because of this angle. This is not the only possible way or reason why notes can get choked off, but that's, the, that's what's happening in your case. Okay, so let's try it again, and don't turn your wrist so much, just straighten it out. Okay, look, sure. look, at the, look at my hand now, look here. Here's how I play, here's mm -hmm. how you play. Here's how I play, here's how you play. Okay, good. Okay. The notes are getting choked, but they're not getting choked now because of your thumb. Now they're getting choked, and I suspect it was also happening a little bit before. You have a sync, there's, the two hands are not totally in sync. You didn't. So I can choke the notes too without my thumb ever touching the strings. So I choked mm -hmm. them all, but my mm -hmm. thumb wasn't the, yeah. the, the problem. It's synchronization.
That makes sense? Mm -hmm. So it's a synchronization issue we're having currently. So what to do about that? Slow down, and you have to connect the notes. Don't remove the fingers before they're supposed to come off. So we're going to go slow. What you're doing is you're playing a note, and it's supposed to last until here, and you're playing it, and then before it gets here, you've, mo you've removed a finger, or you've got the pick already touching the string. So you're choking it off. And what we hear, the distance between those two things is either noise or silence. Okay, so you're doing mm -hmm. this. I'm exaggerating. It's not this bad. That's what's happening. It's not n anywhere near the severe, but yeah. that's the effect. Okay. Mm -hmm. Versus this. Nothing's being choked here. Because the notes are lasting their full duration. Make sense? Yeah, gotcha. Those are the things you need to work on. Okay. Okay? Okay. All cool. right. Good job. Okay. Thanks. Awesome. You're welcome.